Welcome, ladies and gentlemen, to one of the most anticipated quarterfinals in World Cup history. It is the French, the host nation, up against the Springboks from South Africa. The Springboks had a good start to their World Cup pool by beating Ireland quite convincingly, but then had a shock defeat to Tonga, while France have gone down to the All Blacks and also narrowly escaping the United States. So all to play for here today as it's going to be in Tamak to get this quarterfinal clash underway. A deep kick in from him collected by Tia Lendi for the spring box. Will they get possession back? It looks like France have stolen this on the ground almost immediately. Here they come. Release. On the 10 meter line inside Advantage. South Africa half. Advantage to France. South Africa was offside. So Trevor Nyakane got caught offside and a chance now for France to get the first points of the quarter-final. There you can see Nikane completely offside there and a chance for France. Ntamak surely in his range should get this and that is going to go through so three points to nil France lead this quarter-final clash after four and a half minutes in this game. So Andre Pollard with the restart there in the high hanging one. Collected beautifully by France and getting pushed into touch there. So it is going to be a Springbok line out on the, well, just outside the 22 of France. Bongi Munambi with the throw in. Collected by Peter Steff, the Tway. Now South Africa form the mall. Here they go. The mall is going forward now. Good drive from South Africa. Now gets to a stop. Fuck the Clark. Out it goes to Kutsov. Now Pollard and a high tackle from France. And it's going to be a yellow card to Damien Pinto for France. Something that they don't want in this quarter final clash. So what will South Africa do? They do opt for the penalty kick at goal, so just to level up the score. Pollard draws back and snap. Over it goes, so three points all in this important quarter-final clash. Twelve minutes gone. Kickoff taken by Peter Steff to Twain. Now Dia Lendi offloads to Cheslin Colby. Here goes Colby, beats one defender. Still going. Now gets it out to Andre Pollard. Needs support, got him there. Now what a Galant. And Galant is going to go over for the first try of this game. Great play from the Springbok back line. And putting the French under immense pressure with that yellow card. Great offload there to Cheslin Colby. Look at the step inside. And more impressive with the pass out to Pollard. And then the offload to um, um sees the moment. Passed out to Galant. And over they go for the first try of this quarter final. We've had 15 and a half minutes gone. Pollard with the conversion. No problem as it struck beautifully. So 10 points to 3 it is after just 17 minutes of the game. Restart from Tamak. Fall oh, beautifully collected there by France. And a chance for them now. Seems like they have stolen this. this fr well, France have got it back, so here they go. Chance now for them to attack as well. Mashant, out it goes to Fakatawa. Just outside the 22. Now a good opportunity for them to attack from here. Gets driven back in that tackle to Pont. 
Now there's a bit of room for them into the hands of Gail Fico. It goes to Pont pick and go again. Off it goes to Release. Willem, sir. Now a nice little drive from the open side flank of France to Pont. Out it goes to Machant again. Still in possession is France. 25 minutes gone. France still on the attack now. Fico back inside it goes to Aldrit. Stolen by Bonambi on the ground. Dwayne Vermeulen's got it now. Pop the clerk, out it goes to Colby. Colby's got plenty of room to move here. Sidestep the last defender, but the cover defense is good. But the pass inside to Pollard. Now South Africa just outside the 22 meter line. Out it goes to Dwayne Vermeulen. Quick recycle ball needed for South Africa now. It's coming back rather slowly for them now. Peter stepped it away, bumps off one defender. Still on the attack is South Africa, but it looks like France have stolen this. And here they come. Kick downfield by Fakatawa. Buff the clerk is underneath or behind that now pull up. South Africa in a bit of pressure now. Looks like they are gonna get this ball back. So now it's a bit. Out it goes to Kutsov, gives it out to Dialendi, back inside to the clerk. Hammered in a tackle, but still they go. Now Dwayne Vermeulen, out to Pollard, back inside it goes to Etzebeth. South Africa just securing possession at the moment, and Colby every time has found a bit of space, just couldn't get the offload to Fak de Klerk. And now France have got possession of two minutes to go in this first half. Good tackle from Colby there. France to Pont, out it goes now, opportunity for Baltier. Release. They're now inside South African half, here they come. Little bit of a poor pass to the back line there, but they've managed to recover, but picked up by Etzebeth for the Springboks. And a chance now for the Springboks to maybe counter attack here. The Hoot has gone for half time already, and Fop the Clark says that's going to be it. We are in the lead, so... Let's go to half-time, regroup, and with 40 minutes to go, we are in a comfortable seven-point lead. You can see how close it is, France having the territory, basically the same amount of tackles and handling errors. Three offloads from South Africa was probably the difference in that beautiful try that they scored. Now the kickoff from Andre Pollard. Goes quite deep with that one. Release. Well, look like South Africa's counteract this. And now there's a chance here for them. Andre Pollard has dropped back in the pocket. Can he get there for them? Looks like he can. That's a solid drop goal and over it goes. So 13 points to 3 it is. Moment of brilliance from the fly half there. What can France do? Can they come back into this game? Peter Steph to Tway, out it goes to Dialendi. Finds Pollard again. Stolen on the ground by France. So now a chance here for them. Taken in beautifully by the open side Release. flanker for them. Just outside the 22. Oh, brilliant little breakthrough from the lock there. On the 22 meter line, France go to Pont. Slow ball coming back for them now. Pierrot, Fakatawa spinning out of one tackle. Release. Massive tackle from Kulisi there. Taken up again. Now there's an overlap if they went wide. Release. Gets driven back in the tackle there, trying to catch South Africa off guard. Still comes France. Pick and go from Huas. Good defense from Mapimpi. France need to go to the right. Dupont gets hammered Release. in the tackle. Still in possession for France though. Out wide they go. Fakatawa. Still inside the Springboks 22 they go. 
Great little offloads from them now. Back inside they go. Stolen by Kitsov on the ground. Brilliant work from the Springboks there. Bollard out to um under pressure. Intercepted by France. Another steal on the ground from Kitsov. And South Africa looks like they're going to survive this onslaught from France. Great kick downfield from Pollard. But it's not gone out. France trying to run this now. What can they do? Comes back to the forwards. Pick and go to Pont. Out it goes to Bautier. Still France through who us. Through who us beats a couple of defenders. Pierrot. Stolen again by Luit the Jager on the ground. Good work from the forwards of South Africa. Now the Claire Colisi. Out it goes to Pollard. Lukanya Am. Nice little offload to Peter Steph the Tway. Coming back slowly for South Africa now. The Clark spots a bit of space at the back. Puts it over the top. Lukanya Am is chasing after this, but Dupont is there. Good cover from Anton Release. Duponte for France. Going to try and run this from the round 22 now. Fakatawa out to Galfico. Good defense from the Not Springboks releasing. again. And this time it's going to be a penalty against France for holding on on the ground. So an opportunity now for South Africa to almost seal this game now. What are they going to do? Definitely having a shot at goal here. The kick from Andre Pollard should be an easy one for him. Gets it beautifully, so 16 points to 3 it is. France their own worst enemy at ruck time today. Just too many turnovers from the rucks. Beautifully taken again from the kickoff from France. Area where they dominated South Africa quite well. Dupont goes again. Release. Now a chance here for France Release. if they can spread this ball wide. But this defense from the Springboks just relentless at the moment. Oh, great handoff there on Trevor Nyakane. Eight minutes to go. Taken in by Phillips for France. Now another chance here. Bamba back to Machan. Now there's a chance here to Pont. Good defense from the Springboks initially. Inside the 22 goes France now. Chance here for them. Oh, that brilliant pass out to Bartier. And France gets a try with four minutes. Great change of angle there from France. As they completely caught South Africa off guard there. Just have a look at this replay again. Looked like they were going infield for all money. And then just Aldrich just changed the whole angle. And out it goes. For a brilliant try for Bautier for France. So important kick coming up for Romain Tamak now. If he gets this, France can still win this. It's a brilliant kick. It's going over. So 16 points to 10 it is. With three and a half minutes to go. Can France steal this from South Africa? Andre Pollard with the kickoff there. High hanging one from him. Beautifully taken by France. Here they come. A minute to go. They're inside their own half on the 10 meter line. Good defense again from the Springboks. The Hooter goes in the background. So France have to do it all. The mall has been formed on their own 10 meter line. Driving forward is France. Still going up to halfway. It's now or never for France. Takatawa tried Release. to get past it's a bit there. Here they come again. Not a space here for Gal Fico. Fico goes up to the 22 meter line, but Geland has got him into touch. And that's going to be it. South Africa has beaten the hosts. 
to qualify for the semi-finals. They have dominated most of this game until the last 10, 15 minutes which France came back. But in the end, South Africa good enough to hold on. And that's the end of the road for the host nation. A great performance from South Africa. Hope you guys enjoyed this. Until next time, this is the Rugby Guru. Cheers for now.